everyone, welcome back to Angels Light Tarot. Thank you, thank you, thank you for stopping by for our daily message for Wednesday, September 8th. 2020 and of course yes you know we're starting with the love bird bonus for those of you who are in a beautiful beautiful romantic bond angels and guides angels and guides positive energy for the love birds for yes for 24 little hours yes 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 and Hmm, what else is going on here? Angels and guides, angels and guides, positive energy. Yes, 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 for the lovers. Of course, of course, we're checking in with the fairy dust as well. Angels, what's going on with the lovers? For, thank you, thank you, angels. Fairy dust. Okay, so we have maturity and lead the way. Take the reins today. Others will follow if you lead the way. So, yes, your relationship is going to a whole new level. But only, only if you take the lead. This is a positive thing. Someone, someone is adulting in the relationship. Someone is doing the right thing. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so singles, positive energy, positive energy for the singles. Yes, 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 for 24 little hours. What is the love energy for singles? Positive energy, angels, just 24 little hours. There it is. We have commitment and rainbows. In our forest, no trees debate, rainbows stand with love and not hate. Oh my goodness, we are, singles are, committing to love energy. It's almost like singles are throwing love out into the universe, wishing, yes, that that commitment from the universe comes back to us. If we send out love, may we get love back. Yes, we are committed to that. That means we're going to get the love. Singles are going to get the love mm -hmm, that they deserve. Okay, so positive energy, positive energy, positive energy for everyone that is right here right here with me. Angels and guys, angels and guys, 24 little hours. What is going on? 24 little hours, angels, for everyone. Yes, yes, yes. Positive energy. Come on, angels. What is going on? Hmm. Thank you, thank you, and thank you. And we're moving on to, you know it, you guessed it, my mama's deck. Angels and guys, what is going on? for 24 little hours. Okay, now, we're, I feel like we need to add one from the purple deck. <laughs> one from the purple deck. Positive energy, please. Positive energy. Thank you. There it is. And of course, we want it right side up to get all the goodness out of it. Angels and guides, we're topping off our message with the hummingbird deck. Yes, yes, yes. Hummingbird deck. Just two, please, angels. And there's, there's one. And may we have one more, please. Just, just one, just one. Come on, thank you and, and thank you. All right, so ready, yes. As our feet hit the ground, we have the eight of wands. Yes, there's communication coming towards us and this communication is justice. I feel like this is something that's balancing the scales. With the king of pentacles reversed, I feel like there is someone wanting to share something with us today. I feel like this is something that's grounding. Oh, yeah, you can't make that up. With the four of clubs, whatever it is, it's about stability. Stability in love. And this love is long lasting. So someone is, is talking, is talking, is talking, is talking about what is fair in what is right now, if that makes sense. Someone is losing their intuition. Mm, six of hearts twice. With the seven of spades, there is some, I want to say, some relief that is going on in reference to, yes, a karmic love. This karmic love could be a karmic love with a romantic partner. This karmic love could be with a, a child or, or someone very dear and near to us. But make no mistake, there's conversation. Someone wants to talk about how things are right now. 
Yeah, right now, not tomorrow, not yesterday, how things are right now. And I feel like there's there's a bit of struggle with this. Um, this, this is not some because I feel like this love is a long lasting love. It wasn't necessarily, um, like I said, it could be with family, it could be with family members, or it could definitely be with a romantic partner. But I feel like someone is talking about the security of the relationship. And I feel like there's a part of you that wants to let it go, wants to let this love go. And almost like maybe you're freeing someone, maybe you're freeing the energy, maybe you've been overly possessive with a child or overly possessive with um, a friend or, and, you, and you need to kind of, yeah, back up a little bit because today it just feels like we need to talk about now. Yeah, we need to talk about now because I don't, right now, today, you're like, I don't see this. I, I, I need to let this go. I need to let this go in, it's not letting go of the person per se. It's letting go of the energy that's attached to it that feels like it's weighing you down because the seven of spades is like negative energy, worry, things of that nature. But on the high side, it's literally freeing yourself from this energy, from this karmic relationship. And like I said, this karmic relationship could be with a love partner, could be with a child, could be with a friend, whomever it is. It, I feel like this love has been weighing you down and you're ready to let it go, okay? So, I send you joy, namaste, and much, much love sent your way.